Hyperscalers have shown us how to make very large, very scalable, but still very efficient data centers. When I think about future of data centers, I think about an enterprise data center which is built along the same lines as the public cloud. And what we have done at Broadcom is we have looked at some of the advantages, some of the benefits which were available only to the hyperscalers, and we have looked at how we can enable those for everyone. So for example, Sonic, software for open networking in the cloud. Sonic is an open source network operating system that was developed by Microsoft for the Azure cloud, but they made it open source in 2017. Sonic is a fantastic open source network operating system for data centers. But when we first looked at Sonic, it was very much inclined to public cloud. What we did at Broadcom was we started enabling features in Sonic like VXLAN eVPN, like telemetry, like time synchronization. So we made Sonic more enterprise class. And with that, now many of the enterprise customers have started adopting this. And the other thing we did was there are certain silicon enabled telemetry features available in Broadcom Silicon which can um, enable customers to get to root cause analysis very quickly, which can enable customers to understand if a, if a network, if an application performance issue is caused by the network or not caused by the network. All of these uh, telemetry features, they were previously only enabled to megascalers. With Sonic, we have enabled all of these features for the enterprise class customers as well. We are taking Sonic from a 51.2 terabit per second silicon to a 0.1 terabit per second silicon. So with Sonic, we are democratizing networking for everyone. Thank you. Mm -hmm.